Most of India lives in climatic zones that require cooling for comfort most of the year, while a small part resides in cold climatic zone that primarily requires heating. While thermal comfort is a basic requirement for all residents, current practices of residential design and construction do not necessarily take these needs into consideration. Eco Nivas Samhita 2018, the Energy Conservation Building Code for Residential Buildings, aims to change this by putting forth an important regulatory measure that ushers energy efficiency into the residential building sector. Part 1 of the Eco Nivas Samhita 2018, launched by Bureau of Energy Efficiency and the Ministry of Power, focuses on the building envelope of residential buildings. The code sets minimum building envelope performance standards. These include limiting heat gains for hot climates and heat loss for cold climate, improving natural ventilation potential and Improving day lighting potential. The code provides flexibility in design and construction material to meet the compliance, such as varying the orientation, wall type, roof type, window size and type, type of glazing and external shading for windows. The code specifies a maximum value for heat gain rate for all climates requiring cooling called the Residential Envelope Transmittance Value or RETV. It applies to the entire building envelope except the roof. RETV depends on A. The area of the external wall and the properties of the walling material and B the area of glass used in external windows, doors and ventilators and the properties of the glass. In cold climates, where buildings require heating, should adhere to a specific maximum U-value. The U-value, applicable to the entire building envelope except the roof, determines the amount of heat loss that occurs through the envelope construction. Lower the U-value, lower the heat transfer. For the roof, the code specifies a maximum U-value, which determines the amount of heat transferred through the roof construction. To ensure adequate natural ventilation, the code specifies minimum openable window to floor area ratio. At the same time, the minimum visible light transmittance or VLT of glass specified in the code ensures adequate daylighting through the glass in external windows, doors, and ventilators. The code requires simple calculations. This can be used by architects as well as engineers and will not require any simulation software. An online compliance tool is also available to aid in the calculations and compliance check. For the code to be taken up and followed nationwide, it is essential for all stakeholders to come together and take it from strength to strength. Let us come together to ensure adherence of the code so as to reap the benefits of energy efficient homes that will enrich not only the lives of homeowners but the nation as a whole.